Wait, there's a theater in the middle of the singing? Oh, I guess they did that before too. Wow, the trial sure is racing towards a thrilling conclusion. Do you know who the culprit is? Obviously I know, because I know everything. Yeah. What? You know everything? Yeah. No, everything. Sammy knows everything about anything. He basically traded his bare head for godhood. Yes, he has betrayed his earth sign ancestors. Traded? No, I'm still obviously a bear. It's obvious, right? Right, you guys? You sure ain't no fish, but you damn smell like one. Who you lucky be? Anyway, since I know everything, I'll give you the whole story later. Try your hardest to nab the culprit. And believe me, that's no lie. I lied. It would shake the game to its very foundation. So trust me, and please enjoy the class trial without any worries. I feel like we're getting close to the gory part. It's making me nervous. I don't know who the culprit is, but I'm not paying attention, so it's okay. Yeah, but there's one thing we do know. The line between victim and attacker ain't as clear as you might think. I suppose that's one lesson we can take away from this case. A cup leg void poison spread, fast spring, flowers will grow from the stem. Say something already. Some type of silence speaks volumes. I fucking knew you were the culprit. But wait just a minute, now that is possible. Shuichi was with me the whole time we were on lookout. When are you suggesting Shuichi killed Rentaro? Are you really together the whole time? Huh. What do you mean? I'm asking if you two were on the couch together the whole time. But, but I guess we weren't together the whole time. I'm gonna check out the basement. I'll, I'll come with you. No, you stay and keep watch, Kaede. So that's when Shuichi went to kill Rantaro. No! Shuichi wouldn't kill anyone! Don't become emotional. We must seek the truth in a calm and logical manner. Our all of our lives will be lost here. I'm not being emotional here, I'm saying it with conviction. Even if Shuichi did go to the basement, he couldn't have killed Rantaro because... Uh, security sensor going off, probably? But see, the, the time is the most suspicious, but that's like, pretty vague, so I'm gonna go with this one. But that could be countered by Shuichi having the receiver and being able to switch it off. The security alarm didn't ring until after Shuichi returned to the classroom. It only rang after Rantaro moved the hidden door, which means he was still alive. If Shuichi was with me when the alarm went off, that means he's not the culprit. By the way, I want to confirm one thing with you, Kaede. Who set the security sensor on the bookcase? It was Shuichi, right? 
Dude, what is that face? It's fucking creepy. Is that like a mask, actually? Huh? Then I'll set up a camera that's connected to the security sensor. I'll set it carefully so the camera has a clear shot when Mastermind moves the bookcase. Let me take care of the security sensor on top of the bookcase. And we'll set the cameras near each door. Yeah? Shuichi was the one who set up the security sensor? What about it? Did you actually check for yourself if the sensor was set on the bookcase, Kaede? No. I didn't check. Did it ever occur to you that Shuichi could have lied about setting the sensor? Hmm? Uh, a lie? Shuichi pretended to place the sensor on the hidden bookcase door. But in actuality, he was holding on to it the whole time! And when he met up with you, he secretly triggered the sensor to make the security alarm go off. That would cause Kaede to assume that someone had moved the bookcase. I see, sneaky little fucker. But that still doesn't make sense because we saw the bookcase closing as we ran into the room. Oh, at this rate, everyone's going to think Shuichi is the culprit. I have to do something. I know for a fact that he's not the culprit. So, I gotta do something. From this point on, lines of white noise will appear to disrupt your reactions. Stellar. Silencer is the left mouse button. But it's actually the right mouse button, or, yeah, no, I guess it is the left mouse button, but it'll probably say it's the right mouse button because the text says left mouse button before. Lines of white noise will appear to disrupt your reaction. Your truth bullets will disappear if they touch these lines, so think of them as obstacles. Please time your bullets right so they won't get interrupted by the white noise. You can use the silencer with left click to shoot down the white noise. Now why would you do that? Because not only does that make it easier to shoot the right weak spots, you will also get additional time. What a great deal. Use it to your heart's content. Is there a V silencer? Thank you for the opportunity. Alright, so what is the truth bullet here? I know it's the moving bookcase. Turns out Shuichi really had it the whole time. It's, it's when we ran in, so I guess the front entrance foot was probably. So Kaede heard the sensor go off. She figured someone had tried to move the bookcase. Only an idiot could make that mistake. Say something. Alright. Shuichi couldn't have had the sensor on him. That's right. I should have evidence of the proofs that beyond the shadow of doubt. Is that just because of the receiver? Then, I'm gonna try this though. No. If Shuichi was in charge of setting the sensor, then we don't know if he actually did it. But the booming bookcase should be the issue there. He used Kaya as a patsy to make her think that Taro was alive when the sensor went off. No contradictions there, right? Oh, God. I have put myself in a bad position because I am dense. Obviously, the, the, we have the photos so the sensor is working. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. Wait a minute, this is weird. If the security sensor wasn't placed, then... We wouldn't have been able to take that picture. We were only able to get it because the sensor was triggered by the hidden door. Oh, that? Psh, easy to explain. Well, you see. 
Ah, uh, I guess you're right. Sorry. I didn't think that far ahead. You're giving up that easily? Yeah, I mean, what else? I made a mistake. A big deal. Let's get out of big take, though. You speak as if you knew that from the start. Even I was taken your mind. So you see, Shuichi can't be the culprit. Now wait just a minute. Yeah, no, that's tasty. Security sensor had a power supply. So what if it went like this? Security sensor was set up on the bookshelf, and Shuichi had its receiver. However, uh, Shuichi turned the receiver off. See, yeah, that's what I was saying before. Huh? How come? That would give you a picture, but no alarm. When Antara opened the bookcase. Then, when Shuichi says he's gonna check the basement, he actually goes to the library. But he wouldn't have known to do that. And thanks to the 30 second interval, he's got time to go in after Antara. He could have collected the sensor from the hidden bookcase after killing Antara. I see. Then he caused the receiver to go off in front of Kayane to trick her. It's certainly plausible, considering that Shuichi knew about the intervals. Yeah, how needlessly complicated. But I guess it's not impossible. Then, Shuichi really is the culprit. <laughs> So the ultimate detective is the killer. What a plot twist. Wait, why do you guys think he's the culprit? Shuichi, please say something. Why aren't you saying anything? Shuichi, what's wrong? You're not culprit, are you? Hey, you gotta say anything? Well, I'll vote for you if you don't. Are you okay with being the culprit? Are you ready to turn yourself in? What should I do? Everyone suspects Shuichi. There's no way he's the culprit, but even so... Why won't Shuichi say anything? Is there a reason he won't say anything? If that's the case, then it's all up to me. To protect everyone, I need to take control of this debate. Even if that means I have to lie to do it. Did you hear that? A lie? Now, I know that sounds crazy. Telling a lie in a class trial? But sometimes, telling a lie is necessary to reach the truth. Oh, but don't worry. There are no lies in this tutorial. From here on out, there will be times in a debate you have to lie. Before, you had to refute the lies, but now you'll have to lie yourself. Doesn't that get your heart pumping? Here's how it works. Select a truth poll like normal non-stop debates. But when you poll right-click, the truth bullet will become a lie bullet with the opposite name. Releasing the lie right mouse button will shoot the lie bullet. When you use a lie bullet to argue or agree with someone's statement, it will become perjury, a statement that paints over the truth with lies. While lying, your influence gauge will drain. A successful lie will restore it. Shit, I don't have much of that right now. But if you miss with your lie bullet, you will take damage, so be careful. Also, I've heard a rumor that there's a secret way to advance debates. It's called a back route. Let's just say that only those who lie well will be able to find it. What the fuck? I don't think I get that. Thank you, Muchly. Christ, this is some pressure.
So obviously we should save our security, which is what we need to lie about. The security sensor is placed on the bookcase. And also had the receiver. Sorry, you guys. I forgot to tell you something important. Forgot? To tell you the truth, it was me. I had the receiver. Huh? So that's why there's no way Shuichi could have turned off the receiver. If that is true, then the entire premise of the argument thus far is wrong. Is this true, Kai? Of course. Come on, would I lie to you guys? I only screw yourself over. If we mess up, you're dead too, you know? Or perhaps you wanted to come and quest Shuichi even at the cost of your life? Huh? I cannot imagine why anyone would risk their life to lie on another's behalf. Words from a true, heartless robot! Emotions are only for meatbags! That is a harmful stereotype. I can produce heartfelt remarks through calculations. Like, less than three? Those kinds of calculations? It's not so unthinkable. All hearts are blind and based on radiant love. Doing anything for the one you love. Hasn't everyone felt that way before? <laughs> I most certainly have, at least. With how creepy you are, I'm sure that person didn't want your love. Kaede and Shuichi are pretty buddy buddy with each other, so I wouldn't doubt that. Plus, the way Kaede had just acted right now, I'm pretty sure she lied. A talented liar like me can spot other people's lies easily. Well, what do you guys think? To believe or not to believe, Kaede? Um, I do want to believe Kaede, but Shuichi does seem pretty suspicious. He's been strangely quiet for a while now, which is classic degenerate male behavior. Yeah, I agree. Shuichi is the only person here who is suspicious. So, we all agree with Poichi, did it? Now let's just vote already. No, I think it is still too soon to determine the culprit. Uh, I agree. I sort of can't believe that Shuichi is the culprit. Yeah, this ain't right. I agree. But I don't know if Akta agrees. Because right now, it's his nap time. This is quite troublesome. It seems our opinions are almost ends. How are we supposed to decide? We're split right down middle. Split! Did you just say split? You did! I heard it. I heard it with my belly button microphone. So, so wait, your ears don't do anything? The Ultimate Academy is proud to present its very own, more phenomenal trial grounds. More phenomenal trial grounds? The trial grounds are gonna morph? Seriously? I totally want to see that. Either way, we have to do something. We can't vote for Shuichi because he's definitely not the culprit. If we vote for him, all hope is lost. I won't be able to save everyone. 
but I haven't lost hope yet. I won't give up. Before I can save everyone, I need to make sure we're all on the same page. We're split down the middle. At times like this, debate scrums are perfect. In a debate scrum, you will be split into two teams. Then you argue your opinions against each other. But look, everyone's so fired up, the subjects of your statements don't match up. That's not how you debate at all. You have to match your subject with your opponents and put them in the correct order. I don't follow this right now. That's how you make a good debate. Your side's subject keywords will be displayed, but your opponent's subjects won't be revealed yet. Listen closely for the subject of your opponent's argument. Before your opponent finishes their statement, use W and S to find the same subject keyword. Then right click to argue the subject with the same keyword. If you and your opponent's arguments match, then your opponent's keywords will be revealed. What the fuck? And then all the statements match up, you will enter the finale. Try to convince all your opponents at once. What the fuck? Rapidly tap the key displayed on the screen to push your opponent's claim out. Don't get pushed back. Push their claim out for a perfect reputation. What the fuck? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I am so confused. <laughs> is this though? I like how the half the dead people's portraits float too. Is Shuichi the culprit? Shuichi is the culprit. Shuichi isn't the culprit. Okay, you hit what you care about. It should be live, right? Oh, I don't think I get this. I Done debating already? Well, this next part's mandatory, so let's get it over with. It's voting time. I don't think I get that game, to be honest. <laughs> Is there nothing else I can do? So. サイハラ君はカメラのインターバルのことを書く。あ、そうだ。でも、イルマさんもインターバルのことを黙ってたし。俺様にはアリバイがあるんだ。サイハラのアリバイだって赤松が証言しただろ。サイハラと赤松はず
Oh, A. It changes. Jeez, that's a lot of voices at once. Everyone, you have to believe me. Shuichi is not the culprit. If we vote for Shuichi, we'll be making the wrong choice. And if that happens, everyone will be executed. I definitely won't let that happen. Even if it costs me my life. Kaede. Yes, just like Kaede said. Shuichi ain't the culprit. Gonta believe in Shuichi too. Gentlemen always believe in strength. No, Shuichi is not a culprit. Then who is? We've already exhausted all possible avenues of discussion. No way. There has to be something else we can discuss. We just gotta think. Right, Shuichi? Huh? Shuichi, even though you're not the culprit, you've been quiet for a while. It's because you realized something, huh? You're scared to reveal the truth. Uh -huh. I thought so. Shuichi? Answer me this. What? kind of truth did you realize? Don't be scared to say it. Not just for me, but for everyone else. Please, face the truth. The picture. Picture? The picture from the camera aimed at the hidden door just before the murder. Ah, uh, he realized the flash thing that I pointed out immediately. I always thought I was suspicious the way Rantara was acting. Huh? What's suspicious? If you look at the picture, it looks like Rantara was trying to remove the camera. But that must mean he noticed the camera we set up. That's true, but when did he notice that? I believe it was when the camera took its first picture. This picture was taken when Mentaro removed the bookcase. At that moment, something made him notice the camera. Yeah, it's totally the flash. So he tried to remove it, and that's when the bookcase closed. The sensor was triggered, and that's when this photo was taken. If that's the case, we must find the reason why he noticed the camera. You're confusing everyone. Except me, of course. Just get the fucking point. I've been contemplating what it could be. Why did he notice the camera? And the answer is... in this picture. I see. Shuichi knows. The reason why Montaro knows the camera is because the camera flashed. Because of the flash, right? Huh? Yeah, flash the flash? Mm. Yes, the flash went off when the hidden door and the camera took a picture. Pantara noticed the camera's flash. But, but how can you tell the flash went off? It's in the picture, you can tell pretty clearly. Well, if you compare it to the other pictures that we have, Remember the pictures that were taken when I took down the cameras? This is the picture taken when I removed the front camera. 
And this is the picture from when I removed the rear camera. And this is the picture of Rantaro. Whoa, the brightness is totally different. Same room, circumstance, and camera, and yet there is a disparity in the brightness. Because the camera aimed at the hidden door had the flash turned on. What was the purpose of hitting the flash on? Especially since it was meant to be hidden. A mistake, maybe? It's no mistake. There was an objective here. That camera was placed for another reason. Another reason? Huh? I know this. There is only one reason the camera's flash was used. To lure the mastermind closer. The flash was used to lure whoever moved the bookcase to the camera. When, so when the flash went off, they would have noticed the camera right away. And that's exactly what had happened. Or exactly what happened. When Tara moved the bookcase, noticed the flash, and then walked over to the camera. But the culprit didn't expect the camera to take another picture when the door closed. Hey, Kaere? What is it? Is something wrong? You've been acting kind of strange. Strange? The last remarks carry more conviction than before. Do you know who the culprit is? Yep, I know. I've known for a long time. Huh? Long time? Because there is only one person able to set the flash on the camera. Isn't that right, Shuichi? The culprit of this incident is... Hit me. Well, this is as far as it goes. I couldn't do it. I couldn't get the mastermind. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry, Rantaro. I'm sorry, Shuichi. You stayed silent this whole time because you realized it already, right? But you can't do that. It may be the end of me. But I want my wish to... I'm giving it to you, Shuichi. From now on, you're going to carry on my wish. You're going to protect everyone. I know what you want me to do. That's so cruel. It's cruel, but... I understand. I'll do it. You can trust me. I won't let your wish go ungranted. 